Don't let greed motivate you to get started in investing. You can hear all kinds of stories about there, how uh, people got rich overnight or, you know, they, they put a little bit of money into a stock and it took off. But then if you keep asking, you'll hear that they didn't sell it. <laughs> and then, you know, it returned right back down to what they had in it. And I can't tell you how many times I've heard that same scenario. So what I told him was, you know, if you can't tell me what a company does, don't don't even consider investing in it. And what I said was, you know, he's like, well, it's not a lot of money. Well, maybe not. But if you're investing $100, you should treat that $100 as if you're investing $100,000 so or a million dollars. You should do enough research in that company that you should be able to give um, a good explanation of what that company does and what its long-term prospects are. Because, you know, what you have to think about is you're, you're becoming an owner of a company, an owner of a company knows a lot about their company. They know how it operates. They know, you know, how it's doing. They know what the long-term trends are. Um, and this is going to be much better than just being at the whims of whatever the market's doing and, you know, how all of those, those things are um, playing out. <laughs> 